Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes. So in this session, we will learn how we can create small animation by using a simple mobile app that is Stop Motion Studio. In previous session, you will learn what is the animation and what is the importance of animation in education and what is the different types of animation and what are the prerequisites to create uh, some animation programs or films. So I'm projecting my presentation. So what is stop motion animation? Stop motion animation is a technique, is a type of technique by which object can be moved automatically. In this, some pictures are drawn. There are different positions, different photos are clicked. And when these images and these photographs are played in a sequence, a movement appears in it called stop motion animation. So basically, stop motion animation is an illusion. For this, we have to do, we have to do three steps. First, we have to draw a picture in a sequence in which we want to create our animation. Then second step is we have to click a different photographs in that particular position. And we have third step is we have to play in a sequence. Then that uh, after the play, some movements are appear. It is called stop motion animation. In actual, in actual, uh, that movement is a illusion only, but it appears like our pictures are moving. So this is this whole procedure are called stop motion animation. So what are the different types of stop motion animation? <clears throat> as we can see on this, as, as we can see on the screen, there are four types of stop motion animation. First is object motion. When we use any object to create our uh, 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 our animation, that is uh, object motion animation. Clay motion. When we use any clay to create animation, that is clay motion. Cutout motion, when we use paper cutout uh, to create animation, that is uh, cutout motion. It is uh, basically cutout motion is a uh, 2D uh, animation. And fourth is puppet animation, when we use any puppet and to create our animation, that is puppet animation. So you can see there are several tools for create stop motion animation which all are free and open sources tool. So today we will learn the stop motion and uh, stop motion studio. This is the app name. Um, this app is by using this app, we will create a stop motion animation. So the app name is stop motion studio. So this is the logo of Stop Motion Studio. This is the compatible for Android user and as well as iOS user. So you can download this app in your mobile phone. So this is the logo of Stop Motion Studio app. Now what material required? If you want to create any stop motion animation by using this mobile app, so what material are required? We need three materials. First, smartphone, of course, because this is the uh, mobile-based app. So we need a smartphone. Second, we need a storyline. We need a story on which we want to create our animation. So we need a complete storyline. And third one is storyboard. In previous session, you have learned about the what is the storyboard and what is the importance of a storyboard. So, in simple words, storyboard is a graphical representation of our movie, our animation, in which all complete story are uh, 
print it on a graphic form like this. This is the example of storyboard. We don't need any technical expertise to create this storyboard. We can create this storyboard by paper and pencil. Here you can see the frame 1 to frame uh, 40 and we have created our complete story on a paper by use by using a uh, pen so this is the example of a storyboard we create our uh, we cre this is the uh, graphical representation of our complete story so this is so, so we need a three material for smartphone second a story or concept on which we want to create our uh, animation and third is the storyboard. So, this is the logo. You uh, you can download it from your uh, App Store or Play Store. Once you downloaded it and you open this app on your mobile phone, this screen will appear. This is a dashboard of Stop Motion Studio app. This is screen called is dashboard. Now you want to create a, uh, your movie. So you can see a plus icon. This is for new movie. When you click on this, you will land on this page. Here you can see some icons are given. On the right hand side, four icon and left hand side, four icons are given. So what are these icons are? You can see the first icon is camera icon. You can see this is the camera icon. By using this icon, you can click the photographs for your movie. And <clears throat> second button is undo button. By using this button, you can undo your work. And third icon is play button. So by using this button, you can play your movie on your app. On the left hand side, you can see the back button. So by using this button, you can go back to your dashboard. And this uh, this mic icon is voiceover icon. So by using this icon, you can record a story in your uh, mobile phone. And you can add your story or narration of your story with your movie. And the third button is plus icon. By using this button, you can add a, uh, external images, external audio, credit, and uh, captions and title slide in your movie. But one thing you have to remember, this app is free, but some features are the paid feature. So you, um, um, paid feature, you cannot add uh, external images which were in your mobile gallery, you cannot add any external images from your gallery, from your mobile devices in a free version. This feature is available in the premium version, which is paid. I think one time, uh, one, uh, one time payment is, uh, one. you have to make one time payment. So uh, adding external images, adding external audio, external music, create it, and title slide is a paid feature, rest are free feature. So you cannot add external images from your device. You have to click pictures to create a story, create animation, and you have to record your voiceover to add audio. So you cannot add any external audio and images in free version. This is available in premium version. So last icon is setting icon in which by using setting button, you can adjust the movie speed, you can adjust the movie quality, you can set the background and you can add any effect. We will see uh, in other slide how we can use setting features. So at the bottom, you can see a timeline. When you click uh, pictures for your movie, all pictures will be shown on the bottom of the screen that is uh, in the timeline so by uh, in the timeline you can add each frame for of your movie we will see in uh, next slide 
So when you click on camera icon, this screen will appear. This is the back button. This is the timer. You can set the timer for uh, clicking the photographs. And by use, by pressing this button, you can click photographs. And this is the play button. And these bars are, when you click on these four bars, you can adjust the text size, uh, brightness, zoom, ratio. These settings are given in the four bars. So this is the timer. When you click on timer, you can set the timer for clicking photograph. So this is the timeline. So I have created a storyboard for the famous story, the Thirsty Crow. And I have clicked, you can see I have clicked 37 frames for creation with animation. So I have uh, used paper cutout to create this story. So this is the paper uh, cutout uh, motion story. You can say that. So you can see all pictures are appearing in the bottom. That is timeline. So if you want to edit any frame, you just click, select the frame. Yes, I have selected fifth frame. When you click, uh, select the frame and long press on it, you will get the this pop-up with the editing feature. You can see the editing options are given here. First is insert camera. If you missed any frame in between, for example, if you missed any frame between 20th and 21st frame, or you want to add one frame between 20th and 21st, you can insert camera and click photo by using insert camera. So you can add any frame between the timeline. Second is pause button. By using pause icon, pause, pause button, for example, if you want to uh, give any written instruction in your animation or you want this slide will be stay long on the screen, you can add pause but pause on that particular slide. If you for example, if you want to, that particular 20th frame will stay longer on the screen because some written uh, informations are given for the students. So you can apply pause for 10 seconds. So that particular frame will stay long tens for a, a 10 seconds on the screen while you play the animation. So you can use pause button uh, for uh, any slides. This is the audio icon. So you can use uh, audio icon, audio feature to insert any external audio or editing your recorded audio. If you want to edit your recorded audio, so you can click on audio set audio button and you can edit, delete your recorded audio. As well as if you have a paid version of this uh, app, so you can add any external music or audio from your device by using this button. So this is the select button. You can select frame. You can cut frame, copy and paste it. And uh, you, here you can say some icons are disabled. There's a reverse and merge icons are disabled. So these features cannot be used in a free version. These features are available in the premium version. And this is the delete icon. You can select frame and delete it. So these editing options are available for each particular frame if you want to edit it. Now I have clicked my uh, complete frame and I have edited all my uh, frame. Now I want to add audio narration, story narration with this story. So what we can do, we will click on this mic icon. Uh, I have already explained this. Uh, by using this icon, we can record our voice. So you, uh, you will click on this. By clicking on this, this... Uh, this box will appear. Here you can see the record button. When you click on this, you will record your audio narration in your uh, device. By uh, clicking on again, when you click on record button, it will stop. Then you can play it and 
click on done button, it automatically sync with your video. So by using by using this button, you can audio you can uh, record your audio in your device. So by uh, I already mentioned this is there is uh, is a setting button. When you click on this, here you can see the movie speed. So by using this, you can adjust your movie speed. When you set one second, your movie will be slow. When you increase the speed, your movie will be faster. So if you want, your movie will, uh, when you increase number, your movie speed will be faster. So this is the, this is how you can set your movie speed here. And the second uh, button is uh, effect button. By using this button, you can add fade in, fade out effect in your movie. When you uh, want your movie will be start in fade in effect, you can add fade in effect and you, your movie will, will be end with fade out effect. You can use it. So this is the effect uh, icon. You can uh, use various uh, effects in your movie. And the third button is the aspect ratio. You can set the aspect ratio of your uh, movie. And the fourth icon is uh, background. You can adjust your background, but you uh, some are uh, backgrounds are free and some are uh, paid. So you have to see. Uh, you can use uh, only free templates in in the uh, free version. Other templates are. Uh, paid templates. So the next one is filter. You can adjust the uh, filter. You can use filter in, in your uh, movie. And the next is quality 4K. You can uh, you can adjust the quality. You can uh, create in SD format, HD, full HD format. So various qualities are given. You can uh, use but in SD format, it is uh, showing in good quality. So you can, uh, because this is the mobile app or you want to share this video via mobile, so uh, you can use SD quality. It will give a good experience to users. And the last icon is uh, playback icon. So you can set adjust playback of your movie. So these features are given in the setting option. So, so now your movie is completed. You have adjusted the speed, aspect ratio. You have used color filter. Everything you have used. So now your movie is ready. Now what you can do, you will go to the... Uh, this button is back button. When you click on this, you will go to the dashboard. Here you can see your movie is appearing in the dashboard. So this is the dashboard. You can, uh, by using right click, you can rename your movie. Uh, the whole purpose of creating stop motion animation is you want to share this animation, the supporting material with your students, with your stakeholders. So what you can do, if you want to share this video, so what you can do, you will when you click long, uh, when you uh, long press on that particular movie, you will see the blue bar is appearing on, at the top of the screen. So for, um, the first icon is again play preview icon. It will give you a preview whether your movie is final or you want to edit uh, something. So it will give you a final preview of your movie. So this is the preview icon. And the second is sharing option. So you can share this movie in a various format. We will see in which format we can share it. And the third icon is copy icon. So why we need a copy and that a particular resources. For example, uh, if you are, if you want to create this particular uh, program in a multiple language, for example, if you want to create this in English with English uh, uh, language narration and or you also want to create this in, in your regional language. So you just copy it and uh, you can make a duplicate copy of your movie. 
and by editing a audio, uh, you can create, uh, you can record your or uh, record the audio in a respective language in English, in Hindi, in respective language in which you want to create it. So uh, you can create a single uh, movie in a different language also, in a different medium also. So this is the whole purpose to copy of or make a duplicate copy of your project. So you can create a single uh, uh, movie in a different language also. And fourth button is delete button. So you can delete your program from dashboard. If you have created your program and you have downloaded it and you have shared it, so uh, you can delete from your program from uh, delete program from your dashboard. So you can delete it. Now we will see in what format, in which format we can share it. When you click on share option, you can see various formats are given. First is export movie. If you download your program in a uh, export movie format, which is a MP4 format, MP4 format is the most compatible format for every devices. So it is compatible for desktop also, Android, iOS, every uh, devices. So most compatible format. So when you uh, use export movie format, it will download in MP4 format in your device. Second is animated GIA format. So this will be like when you download your uh, movie in animated GIA format, it will download in GIA format. And third one is all images. When you use this format, you can download each frame in a image format. And fourth one is flipbook. So, uh, when you download your program is flipbook format, it will download it in PDF format. Complete PDF will be downloaded. And the last one is project format. This is the uh, stop motion studio app extension. So we will uh, we would not recommend it you will download in project format. Rest are most compatible format. So you will download, you can download your program in rest format like export movie, zip, all images or flip. When you click on export movie, you will get the these options. First, you can directly download the link with the various uh, formats like WhatsApp, um, Gmail, Facebook or here you can see the save video option or you can download this uh, video in your Chrome gallery by using save uh, video I, uh, button. This movie will be downloaded in your Chrome gallery or you can uh, share um, your program by WhatsApp from your gallery. So it will download in your Chrome gallery. So this is the way to share your program uh, with your students or stakeholders. So this is the uh, orientation of the app. Now we will uh, do the uh, hands-on. I, I will show the demonstration how we can create, actually create uh, animation by using this app. So before uh, showing a demonstration, I would like to show you a small uh, example of stop motion animation. So this program, which I'm going to show you, is, uh, is an example of cutout stop motion animation. And this program is created in CIT. So I would like to show you program. Then we will see an actual demonstration of this app. In the meantime, I would like to request to all participants, please uh, download this app in your mobile phone.
I hope uh, audio and video are clear to you. Yes, ma'am. समूह में आदि मानव लेकर बैठे थे कुछ पत्थर कुछ चपटे कुछ थे नुकीले कुछ जैसे हो मोटी कीले कुछ कुदाल कुछ भाले जैसे कुछ मीठे चाकू से So this was the simple example of stop motion animation or uh, specifically cut out motion. Uh, these cut outs, these are the these were the paper cut outs. We will send the link and uh, we will send the PPT also. So the concept was uh, that program was discovery of fire. So this is a very uh, abstract concept. When we uh, teach this concept in the classroom by teaching method, it is difficult to a student to visualize that complete process. So this video was, the duration of that video was two minutes. In two minutes, we can easily, by using this, these types of animation, we uh, clearly explain the concept, difficult concept in the classroom. So that is the power of animation program in the classroom now we uh, so i want to add one point also there is no limit to click photographs in the app and for this animation we have clicked more than 1000 photographs so when you click more photograph your program will be more smooth so i now i'm demonstrating the actual demonstration Uh, of the app, a lot of people are mentioning. So we will take questions if you have in the later. So this is the actual demonstration. How you can uh, use how you can use uh, this app uh, features to create stop motion animation. The 
stop motion uh, animation for the famous story the thirsty crow we must have heard about it so we will create a stop motion animation for this story and we will create this story by using different cutouts we can create a story by using uh, uh, puppet, puppets clay but today we will create uh, this story stop motion animation uh, by using uh, cutouts and uh, here uh, you can see uh, this is the background image background uh, we will use this background for creation of stop motion animation and here you can see some cutouts like a crow and a uh, water jug pebbles and when a water jug with pebbles so we can we will use uh, this uh, these cutouts for creating our animation so we will uh, capture frame uh, based on the storyboards as we discussed earlier we have created a storyboard for this story and we have created a each of frame and we cre uh, we captured these uh, frames uh, these uh, these frames so as discussed here uh, eight icons are given you can see on the right hand side top icon is camera so we will capture uh, this frame by using this uh, this icon so i i am tap on uh, i am clicking on this now you can see a red button we can uh, click uh, we can capture a frame by clicking on the red button so i am clicking on it so this is our first frame now now i am clicking my second frame where the crow is here and click on the red button i will move the position of the crow i will move the position of the crow and i will click the frame again move the crow and click the frame again moving the crow and click the frame again same procedure will do again the close frame i will clicking so now we can see the crow not able to drink a water because the water level of the jug is very low so he, now he uh, he can see some pebbles here so we will uh, rotate the position of the crow and click and we will click some clicks on that frame we will move it on down now as we can see crow picked up the pebble and now he moving towards the water jug and we will capture this frame
we will capture each frame of this process now again we repeat the entire process and will capture every moment we will capture each and every detail now we can see after putting pebbles in the water jug now crow is able to drink water and he is drinking water we will capture this moment this frame and we will click all the frames so we have clicked all possible frames for this story now we will see how many frames we have clicked you can see at the bottom of right hand side uh, 69 frames so 69 frames are clicked for this story now i am clicking on the back button and at the end of the uh, screen we can see the timeline of this uh, story and we can see the every frame of this story so as we are explained earlier we can edit and we can add our voice in this story now we will edit our frames like edit my uh, frames timeline so here we can see on uh, six, uh, frame number 65 uh, the shadow is coming my hand shadow is coming so i want to delete this slide so what we can do we can do is uh, i will click on this frame and this uh, editing options are coming here we can see a delete option i will delete it and this frame will deleted so we can edit our timeline by using these edit option if now if i want to uh, copy my uh, duplicate my frame so i will click on copy button and paste it here so my uh, so the duplicate frame will be created and we will edit our timeline as we are required for now i am going to play this video by click on play button
so you can see the motion in the story in the frames if you realize that we can see the option of an uh, insert camera we can click on this and retake the ana uh, frame uh, we can cut the frame we can copy this frame and uh, we can delete this frame we can erase and edit also and merge and reverse jo uh, reverse i uh, feature will be available for the pro version of stop motion animation now if uh, we can set our um, video speed by using uh, these options i am clicking on setting here we can see move uh, movie speed we can set the speed of our animation movie now i have set 5 seconds per frame we can set as per our requirement 3 second 4 second 5 second 10 second we can use this feature for speed adjustment we can uh, we can uh, adjust color contrast but uh, uh, this feature is available for the pro version and uh, we can use uh, foregrounds so these features these some features are available with the free version so we can use these feature for uh, for our animation now if we if we want to add our voice with the animation we will use the voice icon now i am clicking on voice icon here we can see the record button on the screen by clicking on this we can record our voice and add with our animation so now i am going to record my voice i am clicking on the record icon here you can see the start recording one hot day trusty crow flew all over the field looking for the water for a long time and suddenly he saw a water jug near the tree he flew down to the see the to see if there was any water inside and he could not he could see some water inside the jug he tried to push his neck into the jug but he could not do this because water level is very low then he saw some pebbles he started picking up and picking up pebbles one by one dropping each into the jug and water level kept rising he finally drink water and his plan had worked the moral of the story is think and hard work may find solution of any problem i'm going to stop this recording now you can see all over the field looking for the water for voice is coming with the video he saw a water and we can add narration of a story with the animation if there was any water inside and he could not he could see some water inside the jug he tried to push his neck into now i am going to stop this play and click on done now i am going to play this animation with audio by clicking on play button one hot day trusty crow flew now you can see audio is coming with the odd video so you can create small animation with audio by using this stop motion animation app now we want to share our video with our friends and uh, in uh, with our students so uh, for this we will click on the back button here we can see the, uh, like right left hand side top 
icon is uh, back icon we will click on this icon here this is the dashboard and you can see uh, this is the movie we have created we will long press this icon, uh, this icon, movie icon, so we can see the uh, various icon is appearing top of the screen. First icon is preview icon. If I am clicking on this, we can see the preview of the uh, of our animation. All over the field, looking for the water for a long time, and suddenly. Now I am pausing this, clicking on cross button, so we can preview our video by clicking on preview button. We can see the second icon of sharing. By using this icon we can uh, export our video in various format. Uh, first is in, uh, we can download yeah, export our animation in the movie format we can export uh, as animated GIF format we can export in images format we can export in flipbook format and we can export in project format so um, today we will uh, here we will export our animation in movie format I am clicking on this so after clicking on this there are many options are coming on the screen we can share our video via whatsapp facebook instagram telegram gmail messenger twitter so we and here we can see the various option we can uh, use this option to share our video and we can save our video in phone uh, gel, uh, in our phone also so we can um, by clicking on save video we can download this video in our phone gallery and we, um, phone gallery so we can share our video by using these icons third number icon is copy icon if you want to duplicate your movie you want to copy your uh, make a copy of uh, your movie so you can click on this icon and you can see the copy of duplicate copy of your movie so you can duplicate and make a copy of our video and fourth option is delete option we can delete multiple copies yeah So now, now I'm going to delete this duplicate copy. I'm clicking on this, select on this and delete it. I'm clicking on delete option. So So this was the demonstration of the tool. Now you can try and you can create um, any stop motion animation. And if you want to show here, you can show here. So I can see some questions are here. Ma'am, do we have voice editing tool in the app? In the app, we don't any editing tool. But you can add. A, yesterday, you had a session of uh, audio tool, which is Audacity. You can edit your audio and you can insert it if you have a premium version. Filmora, yes, Filmora is also a nice tool. 
but uh, uh, this is the mobile base which is handy for us so if anyone want to share show any program you can share it no you cannot correct in uh, audio you have to uh, re record If host can give the uh, sharing right to the participant, they can sh uh, share video here so everyone can see how to re record. You have to click on voiceover icon uh, and record your voice. This is the only option. If you want to add any external audio, uh, so you can create animation here by uh, with this app. You download it in MP4 format and add it in open uh, short. Yesterday you had a session in video editing tool also, na? So you can add it here. There, you can create here, download it, and add it here. You can add any external uh, music here. How can we delete pre-recorded voice? So you just click on the frame and edit. I, I'm showing you. Okay. I'm showing you where you can. This is the icon. When you click on it, you can delete your uh, embedded audio. So when you click on the frame, your first frame, long press on it, this these options will appear and this is the icon. How to add background music? Background music, you want uh, external music, you cannot add because it. Uh, this is the premium feature, premium version feature, which is paid. And uh, if you want to add recorded, view, uh, recorded video, recorded audio, so you have to record with use of voiceover icon. You have to record and that is um, that automatically embedded with the video. So, kindly show these steps again to save and share. Okay. Iska marlava dhyan se nahi sun rahe. Okay. So, you just click on after finishing your video, you just click on the back icon. You will back to the dashboard. This is your movie. You long press on it. And these icon will appear. So second option is sharing option. When you click on it, you can export your video in various format. So this is the video format MP4. You can download in mp4 format when you click on export movie you can see you can directly share the link by using uh, whatsapp in email or facebook whatever you want and by using save video icon you can directly download in your mobile gallery okay So this app is very simple app. You no need to any technical expertise to create this. Is downloaded. 
वीडियो इज सेफ हाँ इट्स कम्प्लीटली सेफ प्लीज वॉच माई मूवी मैम होस्ट प्लीज गिव शेयरिंग राइट टू द पार्टिसिपेंट सो दैट दे कैन शेयर देयर स्क्रीन टू शो अस इफ पॉसिबल yes ma'am they have sharing rights so now if you want to show us your program you can share your screen or you can create if you have any doubt you can post your doubt in the whatsapp group we all are here in the group we will address your queries Please watch my movie. You can share your screen if you want to show. You can share. Don't post in the chat box. You can share here. Uh, it is not playing we can see your uh, desktop screen only movie is not playing no ma'am in group i don't know so this is not the stop motion animation so i would request to participants show your stop motion animation here if you have created while during the session any program you have created during the session please share that program only मुझे कैसे पता होगा सर so yes you have created a basic video you can add voice over i don't know voice over is there or not i couldn't hear you you can write if you have any doubt you can write in chat box
Someone write, please add me in group. I am requesting from three days. So I would request to the coordinator, please add. Uh, kindly show the speed control key. So in setting option, go to the setting and you have an option of uh, movie speed. When you set speed on one, it will slow. When you increase the number, it will fast. So according, you can uh, set movie speed according to your topic or concept. So, I think you got the idea how this uh, app will work and you have created some program also. You can post in the WhatsApp group so you will learn from the peers also. If you have doubt, you can post in the group. We all are here. We will reply on the group. You just explore the more features Can I add captions? You can add, but this uh, editing, uh, adding caption, title, credits, this is uh, available for premium version. This is not for free version. So if you have premium version, you can add title, caption, credits, and you can also add external images from your device or external music. If you want to add caption, you just record it. You just create movie in, in that app or you can add it in open shot. So you can add, this is the integrated learning. <laughs> so you can create here and you can add it in Audacity. You can add it in open shot. So you don't need to pay anything. You can create for any subject also. Uh, so if you have a concept, you have a content line, storyboard, you can create any, you can create program for any subject. So we, today we have a subject specific sessions also in which you we will uh, give the demonstration for subject specific tools. We have a tool for biology also. So you will. Yes, by practicing, we can improve. Definitely, practice jitna aap karenge, utna improve hoga. Doubts aayenge aapko. So, practice it. And if you have any doubt, you can post it in the group. Please share any link to do well in this subject. We will share this video demonstration video PPT with you. So you can refer demonstration video when you are practicing for this tool. not able to share. I hope your query is resolved now. Not able to share. I already explained. Just go to the dashboard, click on your project and you
got the option of uh, sharing at the top bar. So is there any tool to create animation for computing, a uh, computer programming and also a specific program for commerce? So I have, uh, I will share the list of uh, tools in my presentation. I have mentioned the, some uh, free and uh, open tools list. So I will share with you, you can explore it and use it. So I think no more doubts here. When you practice it, you will have doubt. So, ma'am, kindly once you show how to save and share, okay? Okay, ma'am, I'm sharing my screen. So this is the dashboard. Here your program will be saved automatically. When you uh, click on this, you can see some options. This is the sharing option. When you click on it, so in this format, you can uh, share or save your program. Then you click on export movie. This is the uh, MP4 format. You will get these options. You can directly share your pro uh, video link via these platform or you can download, save your program in uh, on your mobile gallery, in your mobile gallery. So directly save your program by using, by pressing save video. Yes. We will share presentation and demonstration link in the group. So that's all from my side. How many seconds each frame take for voice recording? No, you can just download your voice. It automatically embedded with your uh, video and after that you can just set your movie feed that's it so miss diksha this is that's all from my